Hey everyone, I hope you guys are having a great day. Um, today I want to share with you a kit that I purchased from Carol, who is uh, Free Spirit Arts here on YouTube. A link to her channel will be in my description box. If you're into journals, if you're into um, really differently structured journals, I mean, Carol, I have seen Carol do some amazing amazing journals and um um some are traditional but sh her style is like really out of the box she loves grunge and anywho go check her out trust me you won't be disappointed um she was putting these grunge kits together now i'm a, i want to attempt to do a grunge um journal but I'm the type of person I have to see it in my hand and I have to um, really get a feel for it. I'm a visual person, but you know, it's different when you when you have it in front of you and when you see it through uh, the lens of a, of a camera. So, Carol broke my nose bend. I was doing really, really good. Um, really not buying physical items. Um, I was trying to work through what I had, but I just had to have this kit and she offered it at such a great price that it was just, I, I couldn't resist it. Um, and it came with so much stuff and she put so much care into and thought into putting this kit together. But anyway, I'm just gonna show you cause I've just been jabbering away for like a minute. And I want to make this really quick for you guys. I do value your guys' time that you spend with me. But look at this, guys. And when I tell you it was not expensive, it was not. She added a little note here. Here's the grunge kit. Hope you like it. If I've forgotten anything, I don't think you could have, girl. Look at all this stuff. Hope all is well with you and we get spring soon honey I, I almost i got a taste of summer last week but she added some extras i don't think this was a part of it and i love how she always incorporates some piece of nature this looks like it might have come out from bark from like you know when the trees lose their outer layer super cute i'm gonna have to incorporate that into a nature journal she added this cute napkin yes yeah, spring Every time I see lemons, I always think of when life gives you lemons, make lemonade. Look at how pretty this is with the alphabet. This is really pretty. Thank you for the sleeve. I'm gonna keep everything right in there. Put that in there to protect it and this too. But um, she just finished this dark journal and um, it came out gorgeous, 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 gorgeous. Look at this. Look at that. Look at the grunginess. I love it. Go ahead, Dolly. Break the bag. Why don't you? Look at this. What is this? I know she makes a wax, uh, like a stain. And it gives it a shiny feel. I, I need to try that. Look at that. Isn't that just, I, I just love it. I love it, I have no words for it. She does this faux leather technique that I wanna try as well. That's that, and she protected everything in baggies. And she thought of everything. So we have some coin envelopes. She does these corners, look at that, with her stitching. So we have some corners there. These mini envelopes that she has tea stained. And check out her shorts because you can see she has her whole area in her kitchen or up in her craft room where she has piles and piles of this stuff just drying, waiting to dry. She did some index cards. She has some mini envelopes here. Look at that. It looks like it's been through the moon and back, like it had a rough life. Some, um, these look like tea bags. 
oh my god i'm gonna have to hoard this for a little bit and really think my project through before i even attempt to do a grunge journal which i'll probably end up keeping too i keep everything she did some um gauze and some lace look at this look at that can you see that oh. look at that that's the material and then she also incorporated um, trims and she made a she incorporated a lot there's a lot in here so we have two small trims some of these are vintage she did mention that look how pretty that is oh my goodness look at this look at that this looks like cotton look at the the, the different hues oh my gosh look at this one wow she, I love her little packaging too it's perfect I gotta reuse those oh my goodness Carol you did an amazing job guys if this is your jam Carol's always offering up different kits whether it's uh, original um, ledger paper or accounting paper from like railroad company she had found this railroad book and she was offering that up um, bits and pieces Look at the CD envelopes. I haven't seen these in forever. Look at that grunge. You can even see it on top of the, the plastic. Some envelopes. Every time I tea stain these, these fall apart. I mean, they come unglued, but that's okay because I glue them back together. And it just makes it easier to mat on the inside if that's what you wanted to do. Look at the different hues. Look at this one wow and the plastic makes no difference to me because i can replace that with acetate i always have small pieces of acetate that i never know what to do with time cards this is an awesome kit now we get to the papers and she gave there's a, a huge assortment of pages paper in here including wallpaper so we have some antique and you can feel the frailness of it looks like a science book use of the microscope look at this doily ooh, ooh, let it go let it go let it go Love the different hues. More antique paper. Oliver Goldsmith. Later 18th century. Jonathan Swift. Early 18th century. We have some dictionary pages here. That she ran through the... <laughs> ran through the, the gauntlet. Of grunging. This looks like French, maybe. Love the holes, look at that. It's not even, it's just pulled there and then it just made it shine. Oh, I love this. Then we have some German pages. More dictionary page. Then we have a blueprint or plan. Love that. Look at that. Look at that. Can you see that? We have some maps. Baltimore. Montgomery. York. West York. Adams. Might be close to me. Here's the wallpaper that she put through. Love that. Oh my goodness, look at this. And then she has some 
regular pages. I can never get mine to look this like this. And it's funny because when I tea stain paper and I get like these, I keep those for myself. Because <laughs> I don't think everyone else is going to like it like I do. Let me know if you guys, you guys don't mind those. Look at this. I love that. And then she'd said sometimes with her impatience, the paper did rip. So she added some um, masking tape, which I think adds character. Yes. Not a bad idea. Look at that. She has some ledger paper that she stained. Look at this. Oh my God, Loki. Honey, sweetie. She added music page. And then she said this was like 9 by 12 sheets. Some odd shaped paper that she found. Feels different. Doesn't feel like copy paper. Doesn't feel like... um like um cardstock but it has some you know decent grip to it and she included those oh my goodness thank you so so much i absolutely love 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 my kid carol thank you for the opportunity to get on the list um i was so worried because i didn't see the video to the next day and i was like i'm pretty sure she is sold out but if she happens to um do more at least um, I'm on the list. I'm patient. I can wait. I know this takes a lot of work, a lot of time, and I do appreciate it, Carol. Thank you so, so much. All right, guys, that's all I have for you. Carol broke my nose span, but that's okay. I don't regret it. I've been good. I've been supporting live sales, although I haven't been purchased anything, but I'm there in support. And, you know, I just, it's me. I'm being very thoughtful on what I purchase and having a plan for it. And I do have a plan for this. I just don't know when I'm going to get to it. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Have a great day. And I'll see you real soon. Bye.